The Beaumont Public Library System presents Robin's favorite stories. Today I'm reading I Am Not a Fish. It's by Peter Raimundo. Hmm. There's a jellyfish and he's looking at a sign that says Underwater Support Group. What do you think he needs support for? Let's find out. Um, hello? Hello there. My name is Edgar, and I'm a, um, a jellyfish. Hello, Edgar. Of course, jellyfish aren't actually fish at all. It's kind of confusing. Boy, do we understand that. Starfish aren't fish either. We have arms for crying out loud. And our skeletons are on the outside. Who came up with these silly names anyway? Well, I think it all started when those pesky humans above dove in and started labeling everything. Hmm, look, you see he's got a sign that says giant squid, bubbles, kelp, shark, cod. Hmm, I don't think we really put labels on them like that, do you? Oh, well. Well, I understand the whole jelly part. Sometimes I can barely tell the difference myself. Take grape jelly, strawberry jelly, sea jelly. They do all look alike. But jellyfish? This I never understood. I look more like a plastic bag than a fish. I mean, this is a fish. It has fins see, and gills and scales. I don't have fins or gills or scales. The fish says, ouch. Because I am not a fish. He doesn't look happy. And everyone always says, Edgar, you're overthinking things. But jellyfish don't even have brains, so I'm not thinking anything at all. Believe me, I've tried to be like the other fish. I've joked around with the clownfish. He says, hey guys, why did the turtle cross the ocean? To get to the other tide. Hmm. But I don't have a funny bone in my body. In fact, Jellyfish don't have any bones at all. And I've hung out with the angelfish, but they don't even know what a sand angel is. Hmm. Have you ever made a sand angel? Maybe a snow angel? Oh, and good luck playing tag when your hands are stinging tentacles. Oh, look. Hey there, Mr. Pufferfish. Tag, you're it. But he looked like this. And then puff. And this one time, I even got packed in with the sardines. But Right when I was finally fitting in, I was tossed aside. Hey, that's not a fish. Throw it back. Ah, 
splash. I finally got to a point where I just had to stop and float for a while. Oh, you guys go ahead. I'll catch up later. And that's when I started feeling like myself again. After all, floating is what I do best. You know, just talking to this group has helped me realize something. People can call me whatever they want. Squishy thing, gelatinous blob, stingy fish, Sea jelly, peanut butter and jellyfish sandwich. But no matter what I'm called, I am still me. And that's the best thing you could ever be, said the starfish. Thanks, you guys. I feel better already. I tell you, this group knows how to make someone feel like a star. We're just so happy you came, Edgar. Yeah, you've brightened our day too. Um, excuse me, I'm sorry to interrupt. My name is Charlie and I'm a, a seahorse. Hello, Charlie. The end of I Am Not a Fish by Peter Raimundo. I hope you liked it. It's one of my favorite stories.